An innovative partnership between the U.S. Trade and Development Agency's Global Procurement Initiative and the Government Procurement Law Program at George Washington University is helping emerging economies around the world learn how to purchase high-quality goods and services at the best value. Since 2013, USTDA and professors from GW Law School have been working together to educate public officials on how to establish cost-saving procurement practices. When we were deciding how to structure the Global Procurement Initiative, we, we did a lot of thinking, we did a lot of interviews with the U.S. industry, a lot of interviews with our partner countries in terms of how to best structure what's needed. Uh, we did a lot of outreach internally here in the United States to see what experts would be best uh, for us to use to be able to share and create kind of a vehicle to deliver this type of specialized service. When we did that research, George Washington University, their government procurement law program came to the top of the list. So it's a wonderful opportunity for GW to work with the United States government to basically share best practices and help primarily developing countries improve their public procurement regimes. We have one of the leading public procurement programs in the world, definitely the leading public procurement educational program in the United States. And we think that based on our experience and having worked with other countries, we have a fair amount to offer. And we think that sometimes by talking to non-governmental officials, they may be able to get some perspectives that'll help them develop with greater efficiency. We have really believed that, that government procurement done according to best practices is an increasingly important part of good governance. And so part of what the program is now doing is to attempt to systematize this, to make this learning, understanding of best practices in government procurement available to more emerging leaders in more countries, training as many people as efficiently as we can. The Global Procurement Initiative's extensive curriculum and training provides emerging economies with the tools they need to make better informed decisions about purchasing the necessary items to complete an infrastructure development project. Through USCDA support and the expertise provided by GW Law School, participating countries would ultimately benefit from the long-term cost savings should they implement the new procurement practices gained from the GPI training. We're working with a government public procurement professionals in all of these markets to help them establish value-based procurement mechanisms that can be utilized that would place an emphasis on how to achieve the best value for money for their public procurements and how do they do that and how they obtain that in a fair and transparent manner. I think that the GPI can really promote the idea of the need for procurement training, the need to focus on what they're trying to buy and how they can get the best value for their taxpayer funds. It really seems to me that the GPI can make a difference in pushing the idea of smarter and better procurement systems. As USDDA's Global Procurement Initiative evolves, the agency will continue to rely on its partnerships with organizations like George Washington University. By sharing expertise and best practices, strategic partnerships forged by GPI will not only assist emerging economies with making smarter investments, but will level the playing field for U.S. exporters. One of the things that I think is extremely valuable about this experience is that at GW we've had the unique opportunity to work with many developing countries over the years as their procurement systems have evolved. If we can help other countries avoid the mistakes that others have made, that'll be a tremendous contribution to the efficiency and the ultimate effectiveness of those states. So if our experiences can help those governments operate more efficiently to not fall into the, pit, the potholes that others, others have fallen into, that would be a really good thing.